The Mind Killer, a Dune podcast. I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer. Fear is the little death that brings total obliteration. I will face my fear. I will permit it to pass over me and through me. And when it has gone past, I will turn the inner right to see its path. Where the fear has gone, there will be nothing. Only I will remain. My name is Magnus, and once again, I am recording a solo podcast at 4 in the morning. Welcome to a guerrilla podcast. Guerrilla like Fremen attacking Harkon and Spice Harvesters in the Arrakis Desert. Why? Because I haven't told anyone I'm doing this. Nobody will know about this podcast until I have published it. What is this? Well, it's a podcast about Dune, initially the original Dune novel, but more on that later. Why am I doing this? Well, the short answer is depression. I have been suffering from depression for maybe a decade, and it's gotten to the point in the several past few years, maybe five or more, where I can't read. I have trouble concentrating. I can read short stuff, mostly comic books, but when it comes to prose or even uh, textbooks, I have a really hard time concentrating. I have read, I used to read at least a book a week back in the day. Now I can barely, have barely read a handful of books in the past few years. So I am forcing myself to read, forcing with air quotes in a figurative sense, but really not so figurative. And I'm forcing myself to read something I like. Dune is one of my favorite books. I read it when I was 14 or so, then again in my early 20s, and then I never read it again. Who knows why? I am going to read from a beautiful hardcover edition that I have. It's a 2005 edition um, by the Berkeley Publishing Group, Penguin Group, um, with a cover illustration by Nancy Stahl and cover design by Joe Overovsky. It's really, really, really pretty. And I actually have it because my original copy of the book, which I still have, is a 1980s classic Ace Edition paperback, um, pocket paperback, right? Uh, and um, I lent it to a friend, a very good friend of mine, who had a little accident with the book and the cover came off. I taped it back up. I don't care. I mean, it's it's... I ended up getting the other books from the six original Dune books by Herbert uh, um, in the same edition or the same line of paperbacks, and, and they're nice, they're a treasure. But my friend felt bad, and many, many years later, he bought online this um, hardcover version for me, gave it to me as a gift. So how am I going to do this? I am going to read one Dune chapter, I don't know if a week or every couple of days, I don't know how, how I'm going to do this how I'm going to be able to do this, and then just record an episode with my thoughts about it. Little caveat, the Dune book doesn't actually have chapters with numbers. It's got three books inside of it and four appendixes, but you can actually make out the chapters because they all start with the quotes from Princess Zero Land's writings. So it's, it's kind of easy to do that. I think there's about 34 chapters. Beyond the intro that you have heard recorded and a little outro, these this podcast won't have any bells and whistles. It's just be minimal editing. And they're just going to be rambling. My thoughts. I'm going to take some notes while I read the chapter or after I read it. And then I'm just going to talk about my impressions on the chapter. I'm not going to do research. I'm not going to go deeply into the history behind the book's creation or anything like that. I am going to try to do this at least twice a month, but I can't guarantee it. So in case this is not obvious, this is episode zero. It's just an intro to the podcast. I wanted to do it separately from the actual first episode with the first chapter, after reading the first chapter, which in any case is going to be published together with this, along with this. So it's just that. Until next chapter, or until the first chapter, I will let fear pass through me, so only I will remain. Praise Shai Hulud. The Mind Killer. Studio Roboto. Transmission. 